what can I use to control cabbage loopers? They are wearing out my cabbage. And this is from Mike. <laughs> so they're wearing out Mike's cabbage. So how do oh, we control goodness. the old cabbage looper that does the loop de loop, as Mr. Deep would say, right? Yeah. Well, you know, BT. BT. Uh, yeah, yeah. Real simple spray yeah. on there. Now, every time, you know, hopefully when you're watering your cabbage, you are watering, you know, on the soil yeah, surface and not on the leaves right. so that that BT will stay there. But when we get a rain event, you're going to have to reapply That's that right. BT. Good point. That's a good point. Mm -hmm. uh, the adult moth, of course, flies at night. Not during the day, it flies at night. She will lay single eggs. Once they hatch, she comes to larva, starts to eat those oh. irregular holes underside of the leaves. Can be real bad on cabbage, though, because it can actually burrow into the head of the cabbage. But it, of course, it attacks you know, everything in the coal family. Yes. You know, your leafy yeah. vegetables for the most part. Yeah. But uh, I always tell people, look for the fecal waste, the fecal material. Then you know, yes, that's a good yeah. point. And yeah. you can find the cabbage looper yeah. pretty <laughs> easily right. that yeah. way. That's but right. BT works. Yeah, and yeah, it'd be just so easy good. to spray BT on once yeah. you see that signs of it. Mm -hmm. Even if you can't find the actual uh, Larvae, looper, yeah, yeah you, you, if you see the telltale signs of it, you know, those tiny holes or the fecal matter, then just put the BT on there and you'll you'll be safe. And that'll do it. And BT is safe. It's it safe. is a safe product. Yes, yes. So yes, I, I would yeah. definitely use that. Yeah. Thanks for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed. To subscribe, click below.